the basic technique of focus rigidity cast uh, using synthetic polyester material and synthetic waterproof padding four or five layers of cast on fracture side but slurs layers and proximal and distal edges so it can create strong moldable but comfortable it can be applied to minimum fractures so we can use this for the entire treatment in focus rigidity cast we can use delta cast print and it's made from printed polyester material and had size 3 inches in, a, in this application and has special unique feature with the soccer player pattern. To create a waterproof cast, we have to use a synthetic waterproof padding. We use Delta Dry. It's made of synthetic material and it's very soft so we will not hurt the patient. Here we will demonstrate how to apply Fakusity Decas on distal radius fractures. The, pro the distal edges is not more than the distal knuckle of the hand, so patient can fully flex and the knuckles movement is free. At the palmer, it not, should not more than distal palmer crease, so the MCP joint is free, so patient can flex and extension his fingers. And the proximal is about two finger breadth from the flexion available crease so the patient can move easily flexion and extension. Now we will apply the padding or two three layers of padding and then we go distally and trim a little bit to anatomical position and tuck a little bit and then maybe two or three layers as a distal and trim by scissor and then we go to the proximal and from the Proximal edge we have to make it wider so later we can use it as protections at the proximal side Now we will prepare for the Delta cast print we use Delta cast print with 3 inch size with soccer player pattern We have to wear hands gloves before we apply the cast to protect the hand from the cast in this technique, we only use one Delta cast print and it has a unique feature, it's quite elastic so after the applying cast, the patient will be comfortable and as in instructions, we will soak in the water evenly and then squeeze a little bit to remove the excessive water. As you can see, it's very clear, no mess, not like POP classic plaster. Now we will apply the Delta cast print. We have to put four to five layers on fracture side, and then we go to distal to make two, three layers of cast. Of course, we have to trim the cast to make it more anatomical. And then at distal, we tuck and bend a little bit the padding to protect the skin uh, from the cast, and then we make it mm, very nice. And after that, we will go to proximal, and at the proximal side, we have to tuck and bend a little bit the padding, so the padding will protect the skin. Then we cut it at the end, and we have to make sure that the movement are not restricted, the flexion, extension of fingers, the palmer side, and the dorsal side, we have to check that the uh, cast edges will not restrict the movement. Now comparing with uh, POP classic uh, kind of cast, we have to apply a very thick cast, three, sometimes four layers if the patient is quite big to make it more rigid. And the other thing about the POP cast, we have to think about uh, messy everywhere. We have to clean, it's very different to synthetic cast and this, this is the advantage of synthetic cast. using focus rigidity cast patient can do more movement and patients feel comfortable do more muscle exercise and the most important the polyester cast is lighter than the classical POP cast by using focus rigidity cast and polyester synthetic materials patients allowed to do daily activities without worry conclusion the focus rigidity cast by using polyester, synthetic and synthetic orthopedic padding will give a lot of advantages 
not only for the patients but also for the doctors.